All right, this is Skybreak. It uh, released today on Steam. It's been in early access for a while. I've owned it for about a month, so I've been through uh, one early access update and the release today. I think from looking through when I bought it, that there has been an update every month. They've been fairly reliable about supporting the game. I'll nip into the options. Uh, I have found that the settings don't appear to save, which is a fairly common issue in fact with um, Unity games on Lilacs. So I presume it will be some sort of casing issue somewhere. I'm on high settings with high view distance. I've got an Nvidia 1060, which is you know, a fairly capable card. Not the top, but pretty good. And the game is very smooth for me especially when I'm not recording. Uh, so, we're terraforming a planet. We're researchers. It all's gone horribly wrong. Ships crashed. We have to uh, collect resources, fend off bad things, craft and survive. And yes, it is essentially a sci-fi survival game. Um, one thing... I don't like so much is there's no tooltips on anything. You have to just learn what stuff looks like. And I'm not particularly good with icons. Iconography in general. It's uh I have to think about what it's a picture of and figure out the words. But anyway, there's a lot of these um mechas. And that'll tell me right, so there's where I've got my objective, but there's a chest over here, look. That will have some supplies in. There it is. So let's get that. 18 blaster bolts. And while we're over here, there's a big plant we can harvest. So let's do that. Because like I said, it is a survival game. So crafting, crafting is a... Ooh, one plant. Crafting is a big deal, as far as the, uh, the game mechanics are concerned, so it's worth worth collecting these resources. But at this point, we're sort of in tutorial mode. There we go. Research level increases our crafting recipes. We're sort of in tutorial mode, so I'm not expecting any combat at this point. Quick repair. Right, so I go into the crafting. And my blaster, right. So we can build a quick repair which heals 40 armor points and 15 blasters. So let's build it. There we go, one quick repair. And Let's look at our quest. Find shelter. Alright, we need to find a cure to something. That's the overarching quest. Let's uh, get back to what we were doing. Right, that's where we were going. Let's go that way. So I've not got very far with the story. I've played, the longest I've played a single game for, with was just under an hour. Ooh, logbook. Oh, so this is a new feature to, in today's release, is uh, collectibles uh, with logbooks. I've not actually seen one before, but I guess there it is. Let's carry on with the plot. So this, this is a... Uh, this is sort of a, a base. Your ship will dock there when when you repair your ship, which we're about to do now. And we can call a sky lift from a orbiting power station. No, not space station, not power station. Which you can actually see, look. It's up there. Up we go. Now, before I move on. Let's, uh, item selection, alright, so there's our health, 
Let's select the last three gun. Just before I forget, so this is a space station, you know, your main uh, base. I'm going to go here and use the nano repair system. You can dash back at any time. I'm going to go here and advance the plot. Nothing's there. Oh, there's a weak signal. We will have to join the others. But while I'm up here, I'm going to run around the space station a bit. So here is the uh, basically the upgrades, um, the upgrade station. I've uh, not got any chips yet, so I can't do any of that stuff. Uh, in the next bay is the hydroponics lab, so uh, I've not got to that point yet, but I presume we can plant seeds and grow stuff. And over here is a mecha storage facility. Oh, you see that one's broken. Oh, that one's not got anything in it. So let's go down back to the planet, see if we can capture ourselves a mecha. Because that is one of the uh, sort of key key mechanics of the game. Um, also this terraforming stuff. I'll see it'll keep uh, notifying us about the status of the storm. Right, what was that? There are metres. 129 metres. Right, 102 metres. That's what we want to be at. A spaceship. So we will get some combat now, I believe. It'll pop up. There we go. It'll pop up the tutorial message while we're in the middle of combat. Okay. Hopefully that's the only one around. Yeah, so. I've got a fragment. I can now hack this mecha. go and now the mecha will uh, follow me around and help me which is nice of it now before I forget let's switch back to the blasty gun let's go and harvest that plant and let's uh, head back towards where was it there it was the spaceship So obviously as you progress through the game you'll get uh, more and more powerful mecha companions, you'll also you'll upgrade yourself and you'll also obviously you obviously fight. Ooh. What was the combination? Did I miss the combination? Miss the combination. What was the combination? a bit of a pain. Oh, I've got some scrap. How do I, find? I can't remember how you find the combination out. Uh, we have covered the majority of the, uh, the features of the game, at least as far as the uh, beginner stuff is concerned. It's my mate playing Rocket League again. So let's... Uh, Let's just find, I want to find a base station just to show you uh, what goes on with that. Yep, that's storm level reduced. Uh, 
There we go. I'm just going to go over and look at one of these. So, ooh. Look at one of these so we can uh, interact. So if you use the iron eyes, that reduces the storm level. The storm, the storm will, um, the storm will increase as the storm gets to higher levels. It interferes with your equipment working, so you need to uh, manage that by by going to those towers from time to time and uh, using them. Okay, well, I think that's more or less all I should just show you. Uh, I do quite like the whole. The concept, I quite like the, the graphical design. I quite like how smooth it all runs. Um, I wish I'd remembered what the key code was, so I could advance a bit further. But there you go, that's Skybreak. Released today. Quite nice game, I think. Uh, it's on sale on Steam for release, ten percent off, and it's only about tenner to start with. So uh, worth worth checking out these day one Linus releases. So, uh, Skybreak.